Hello and good morning. Today is day 26 in your hatching calendar. I don't know where I put mine, so I can't show you right now. Um, but we're doing the video a little bit different because some of you found out that our ducks are starting to hatch already. What? So we're gonna talk a little bit about still what's happening inside those eggs. And then um, you guys can just tune in and watch them hatch if you want. We don't have any other activities planned today because of the excitement this week. Um, so day 26 in your hatching journal. I do have my hatching journal. And there's day 26. This is the page we are on. And so our duckies kind of look like this if they're not hatching yet. They're full. They are stuffed in that egg. There they are right there. And some of our duckies are already hatched into that air pocket. I look more like this one. So, you guys are welcome to draw what we see in our little picture or what you guys see in our actual decades. Let me bring you over here. So, I might have to flip you upside down, go the other way. I've got another whole camera system set up here. Really? All right, so we've got our duck name. So this one is Flipper, and you can see he's got that pip in his egg already. Do you see that right there? And if I move over to Pikachu, we see Pikachu not only has that first pip in his egg, but he's actually working on unzipping that top part. You see how his line goes from there all the way up to there? So he's already turning in his egg. And then, I don't know if we'll see it, but um, egg number one, which is Pom Pom. This guy here is turning, um, wiggling, I mean. We haven't seen Pinky wiggle yet. Pinky is this one here. Ducker is egg number three. Ducker is the one that we saw the other day in his air pocket, or trying to get into his air pocket. And so, we've seen him wiggling a little bit. And then on the other side, we do have Flappy, if we can get over there, it's that one back there. And we see him wiggling around a bit too. So there's our duckies. I do I want to talk with you guys for a second about how a duck hatches, because it's really quite interesting. So they first have to hatch in that ear pocket, which we saw egg number three, which is Decker. We saw him doing in the candling the other day. And then once they get on that ear pocket, we talked about how they take their first breaths and then they get out of breaths and that's what causes them to start hatching out of that shell. So they have their bill and on their bill is a tiny little egg tooth is what it's called and chickens and ducks have it but it's kind of just a hard piece on their bill and we'll see it once they hatch I'll point it out to you but they use that to help them hatch out of the egg and that's just kind of like a really hard thing on their bill to help break through that shell. So they do their first pip which is the first hole in the egg we saw and we saw that on Flipper and Pikachu have that first pip. And so they get that little crack in the egg. So pep, 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 pep. They crack that egg and then they have to kind of turn their body. And they do it some more. And they peck, 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 peck. And they turn their body. They peck, 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 peck. And they turn their body. They peck, 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 peck. And they turn their body. Oh, did you see my tag there? <laughs> you turn, they turn their body all around that whole egg and they're just kind of pecking around that whole part of the egg. And so we call that unzipping because that's kind of what it looks like, like they're unzipping the bottom of their shell. And so once they've pecked, 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 pecked around almost their whole shell, that's when they try a big stretch and try to push that shell open. So we'll see them. It's kind of slow right now as they're unzipping in that video. But once they get more and more, we're going to start to see them try to push. And we'll see that shell is going to be closed and they'll push and it'll open a bit. And it's just going to help unzip. They'll push and then eventually it's gonna go into two little shells and we'll have our ducky flop out of the egg. And he's gonna be all wet because he's been sitting in that albumin this whole time. So he's gonna be soaking wet and tired and he'll just lay there for a bit and then he'll flap his head up and flap around for a little bit and then go back to sleep. And we'll see him hitting the other duck eggs and tripping over them and getting stuck in them. And he's just a hot mess when they hatch. 
but they'll dry off in there. He'll get nice and warm. And as soon as we get one duck hatch, he's actually gonna help the other ducks hatch too, which is kind of cool. So keep watching. I'm seeing lots of wiggling this morning. So that's what's happening with our actual ducks today. So if you guys want to draw them starting to hatch, like what it looks like on the outside of the egg, that would be fine. If you want to draw the picture of like what it's looking like inside the egg on some of them, that's cool too. Our sentence could be something like, they are getting ready to hatch. Some ducks are hatching. You could even write their names because it's um, Flipper and Pikachu that are the ones that are hatching right now. And then, um, we'll just kind of keep watching them. So I will put the link as well for where you can watch them. I wasn't able to live stream them um, through YouTube like I thought I could. So I set up a Google Meets that some of your mummies and daddies have already um, hopped on, which is fantastic. So I will put the link and the meeting code in the description of the video. And then you guys can hop on there and just watch as long as the app doesn't crash, it will be on. And then we will send out little announcements whenever uh, anything exciting happens as well. So keep watching those eggs. Um, and then I guess the other thing I wanna show you is this, hang on. This is going to be their home. So it's just a big box. And then um, my roommate, Casey, she lined it with a big tarp um, and a garbage bag. And then we're gonna fill the bottom with wood chips. And then over here in this pile, I have the other goodies. So we have our food dish. We have our waterer. And then this is a heater. Any thoughts on why they would need just food, water, and a heater? Willie wants to heat their food, but it's not out there yet. But I think we have what we need for our duckies. Are there any other things you think we would need for ducks? I'll let you guys answer that question. See what you can think of. And let me know what else this cage needs. All right, guys, that's all for this morning. Tune into that link so you can watch. Um, I am seeing them wiggling right now. You could leave it on in the background all day if you wanted. Uh, that code seems like it's gonna stay the same. So you can just keep using that code if you log out, ask mommy or daddy for help. And I will, do this again tomorrow morning. Okay, see you then. Bye.